My name is Travis Regnier. I'm down here in Nashville uh, playing some beautiful minor cymbals, recording some videos, and I would like to uh, run through some of these and tell you why I love them. Over here I have my 18-inch Classics Custom Dual China. Uh, this is one of the favorite cymbals that I use super regularly. Uh, super trashy, pretty thin. Uh, but it lasts really long, it's a very durable cymbal, so this is a staple in my setup. Love this thing to death. Uh, over here I'm using a 20-inch Byzance Polyphonic Crash. Uh, this thing is incredible, it's very dark, got a bit of shimmer to it. Um, I love big crashes, so it takes a beating, it kind of doesn't fly around too much, and uh, just an all-around incredible sounding cymbal. The hi-hats I almost always use are 15-inch Byzance traditional hi-hats. Uh, all around, they're, they've got like a lot of swoosh, they've got a lot of crispiness to them, just all around incredible hi-hats, great volume, always on my kit. Over here I have a 10-inch Byzance traditional splash, uh, nothing crazy going on, just clean to the point, basically all I ever wanted was splashable, in and out. Up here I have the Classic Custom 8-inch Bell. Uh, it basically does one thing and it goes ding and I love it dearly and I use it probably a little bit too much but that's alright because I love it. Up front here as well I have a 10-inch Byzance Artist Concept Baby Stack. This was a symbol I got sort of for fun originally but I love this thing to death. Again, in and out sort of like a splash but it cuts really well so it can be used as a splash, hi-hat accents like I I almost don't want to play ever without one of these stacks on my kit. For my ride, I'm using the 22-inch Byzance Heavy Hammered Ride. I think that this is one of the best ride cymbals a drummer could use for heavy music. It is unbelievable. The control, the bell, like the bow, everything about it is so crystal clear. It records incredible. It projects live. I don't know what I would do without this symbol in particular. For my crash over here, I'm actually using a 21-inch polyphonic ride, which is a little bit strange, but uh, it's a bit thicker, so it, it washes a bit more, and I really like how a 21-inch crash feels under my stick. I can really dig into it, and it doesn't fly around too much. Uh, this is also an incredible ride, which I use in different situations, but for metal, this is always my main crash. Over here, I have another China. It's an 18-inch Byzance Traditional. And this is actually a symbol I hadn't played until coming to Nashville. I have the trash China version at home, and I wanted to try this one, and I think I just might have to switch because the body of this thing is insane. Uh, I absolutely love the way that the Byzance China sound, but this one in particular is like perfect all around China, and it really carries when I'm digging into it. And last but not least over here, I have a stack that I've put together myself. It's a 14-inch uh, Byzance dual multi-trash over top of a 16-inch Classic Custom Trash China. Uh, and I have that mounted on a Minel X-Hat arm as well, uh, which allows me to open and close it, uh, kind of adjust the trashiness, if you will, uh, which I really like. I kind of run it a bit medium loose so that I get a little bit of sustain, it's not too tight, it's kind of like an accent, but uh, these two symbols go together beautifully. So, I love that stack.